welcome back to Lord Wilson's party. Final mission of Raven Creek. Someone making noise. Unfortunately, yes. Because I forgot it was a noisy floor. I don't know what it was. Light switch there might be a light switch on this side. There we go. Well, we do need to knock both these guys out. So let's get the patrolling guy first. His highly alert friend here. Mm. Aha, okay. And that is all the guards on the ground floor knocked out. Well, he can stay sleeping now. Wait, it's not all the guards in the garden knocked out though. This is the one outside the door that I haven't dealt with. Huh. Maybe he doesn't count as the front guard. Maybe that's the back guard, and maybe it doesn't matter. Is this the museum? What's the dynamite for, actually? It's not the museum. Okay, so we have... Right, well, let's turn on the light, and let's leave... Stake on the floor here. There's a marker. Good, good jump there, Garrett. All trying to. Yeah, they're too far apart, and Garrett's a little too slow to jump in. Okay, so there's a couple of people in there that I haven't yet knocked out. Well, they're not planning to knock out in the bar. I guess it's time to go upstairs. You know what? I've got five broadheads. Maybe I should be heading back out into the garden and exploring the uh, tunnel. Getting out to the garden again is pretty easy. Leave that door open as a reminder of which way I came out. I do not know what is up. We've got what? Five. Okay. There's only one bigger one. That should be the tar a priority target. Oh, there's actually one over there as well. Let's see if we can get them with a the sword. Strange that I did a double death cry, but you know, it's fine. But can you help me instead of just sitting there cawing away? Maybe it's not bigger, maybe that was just my imagination. Again. The hell? What the hell is, that? is up with my aim? Good work, Garrett. Excellent work here. Well, my 
Aaron's not gone at least. Not quite as horrible things you as, won't need that anymore. as the spiders, but uh, I mean, they are basically spider AI. Who is this? The other gardener. Okay, so that's 300 gold. Am I really up to 3,000 already? I don't remember how much I had, but that's, that's good. Alright, well, I mean... I'm guessing he's already dead, right? Let's make sure somebody can find him. Why is the dynamite here? What is the dynamite good for? Well, it doesn't just explode. I mean, maybe I could have dynamited the bugs. I don't need fire arrows or flares to ignite it with the... Alright, well that's one answer. One question answered, one answer questioned. I think that's, still think that's the museum area that I'm going to have to loot later on, but... Uh, now, so that jump I can make. Okay, that, that door I can leave open. But let's close the bar doors for the sake of sound isolation here. Well, it's time to head upstairs. And rather than the main hallway, I mean, I will need to use the main hallway staircase. But that doesn't need to be my primary way up. You can get up here. There's a guard that walks around here sometimes. Oh, lots of lots of gas arrows and gas lights upstairs. But not exclusively gas lights. Oh. Well, that's a very well lit room. Most of the gas lights up here. Is there any way I can hide? Okay, good. Guess it was nothing. No, we're at the main staircase anyway. There's two gold candles halfway down the landing. coming this way. We're not required to knock these guards out, so, you know, I'm going to try and be stealthy. Got all these gas lights everywhere. Where do the guards go? They go out the other, other hole, other door, archway, that's the word I'm looking for. Then that's all good. Yeah, okay, looks good. Oh. Okay. <laughs> nice little balcony. Not 
a nice bigger balcony. There's little sitting rooms by these balconies and nothing on any of them. I guess they provide a reasonable cover. Coming back? Hmm. Must have been rats. Oh shit. No will. Guess we're just nothing. I didn't realize I came back around that way. Okay, so they seem to have a long patrol then. Um... Come here and turn left? Yes. Alright, that's alright then. Neither one has a key. Oh, they go out into the main balcony? Doesn't feel like a safe place. I guess I've got a dark corner here. Just in case he sees me here, but I don't think he will. Who's I'm from, that? So I don't know where the guards are now in this circuit. Here. <coughs> it's darker here. Fancy library. Just wondering about all these footsteps I'm hearing and which ones are on this floor. It's just an archer. Oh, I see. There's loot there. Seems to be only this archer on this floor. That's good news. 
make his arrow as he goes back. Hello? Maybe I'll stop in for a little light reading. No, maybe I won't actually. Is this also an elevator? Hmm. Yes. This one goes up before, okay. Nobody. Guess it was nothing. Right, I see this separate elevator for each floor. Separate guard for each floor. Oh, maybe they've got valuables. In some of the bookcases. The whole crouching, uncrouching when you're up next to an object and suddenly, uh, oh, nice, nice columns. This is very nice columns. Suddenly fling yourself into the air. Oh. Mm. I did not expect him to turn around. I'm quite, glad. quite glad I retreated into the shadows then. Gosh. Who the f who the what hell do is I see there? I don't know, but who the hell are you? You're Lord Wilson. to see things I'd better get some rest okay well this is a productive <coughs> productive excursion I did not expect to find Lord Wilson and his key I was just looking for loot Now I find the light switch. That's right, we can go down down the floor. Anything underneath the elevator? No one knows. Oh shit. He's coming back. I suppose I should check out this floor as well before going to the floor below. Hello. Show yourself. Are they making noise now? Uh, just because I've been here only a few months. I think that they can just get away with pushing me around. I'll show them someday. Someday. It's going to be very hard to, very hard to Supreme Ghost. Do you want to avoid first alerts? Thankfully, I don't care about first alerts at all. I do care about that archer not seeing me. All right, next floor down. Darker. 
Tima. Wow. Built that for Tima. When I see here in the elevator, it was dim. It's a shame I can't read the other plaques. So the one that I thought I was reading was actually uh, just a secret lever. Now we follow this guy around and check all his bookshelves. And is he also going to circle or what? Ah, oh, that's better. Not valuable? Okay, I'll take your word for it, Garrett. Get a better eye than I do. Wonder if there's anything on the by the tables in the center. All the couches. Yes, there is. Let's make sure to grab that. Let me get around there. Pretty well on those lit goals. Okay, so I don't know how this library area connects to the rest. Let's wait for the guard to go and then I'll check out the ground floor doors. would never have thought that moving would entail so much work. I'm totally exhausted. Not only did his lordship have his vast collection of books brought here from his townhouse, he also ordered a ton of new ones. Sorting all these books out and arranging them on the shelves took me nearly two months. I'm a librarian, not a removal man. Then there was the time pressure, all because his lordship wanted to have everything ready for his grand inauguration party so he could show his guests the new library. Luckily I had help from the bookseller, Mr. Tamar of Raven's Creek, otherwise I would never have finished the job in time. Tomorrow there will be another delivery of new books. Mr. Tomar wrote to tell me that he still has seven full boxes of books in his storeroom, all purchased by Lord Wilson. It may be a huge library, but I don't know where I'm supposed to put them all. Hopefully his lordship won't order any more books, or we'll be forced to build an extension. Jonas Quinn, librarian to his lordship. Like he had, like he had to sign his name onto his own diary like that. That's... Is that readable? No. Here he comes back again. Oh, hello. That's valuable. More cigars. I do wonder where we're going to find the portrait of the mother in law, though. If we do. Seeing as the paintings aren't normally captioned, we may not know it when we find it. Okay, and then this looks like an exterior door. Right. That's that car there. Okay. Time for us to uh, head back out. Alright. We got we got away with it. 
luckily. <laughs> okay, so uh, I did look that already. Nice secret access. It's a library. So it did fulfill the first law of libraries. You must have a secret passage in the library. Oh, the oh shit! Somebody's coming. Uh, you know what? Probably a good place as any to sit and observe a guard patrol. So all those sort of guest rooms they were labelled. So the first one was Lord and Lady Wellhofer. That's just what I was going to say myself. Oh, you got valuables. <laughs> yeah, by the bed. Who do I invite? Who do I invite? Well, I guess so tedious, but we do owe him a favor. Marilyn, of course. Sounds like he's planning his own party. It's taking down a notch. Oh. I can see his face when he hears. Noisy floors. I am keep the sound. Confined to this room as much as possible. Don't think we need to steal the towels, we'll leave that for the guests. Just in case he hears strange sounds from the bathroom. Oh, it's just somebody flushing the toilet. Our friend is not inside. Lord and Lady Wellhopper are not in their room. The luggage was brought up. Nice addition to my collection of valuable alarm clocks. Okay. Is that guard friend coming along? Yep. We know he stops and stares at the painting for a little bit, so I should have time to get to the next room. Can't a guy nap around here? Imagining things now. Oh shit, there's a whole lot of. Who's this? Did he color and serve someone or other? Expensive alarm clocks, I love it. Got a golden cat.
So Andre. That's the stairs up again. Where does that guard go then? It means I've gone all the way around, right? The lights there. Oh, that might be our guard friend. <laughs> I, that's probably the uh, mother in law portrait <laughs> stuck in a broom closet. That would, uh, would add up. Yes? Anyone there? Oh, just, just, just a little splash. One of the cake. I take the small cakes. <coughs> we got two more. So here we are. Just disappearing from in front of her eyes, but she probably just thinks she's eating them. Right, this is not the way to approach this room. It's kind of a waste of a water error. Never mind. He doesn't come here, does he? <clears throat> Maybe he comes here on the way back, so I might not have What's too much. That? Might not have too much time. So both go. Seems empty. Oh, he's got the cheap alarm clock. So, so cheap skates. Hacker and Lord, I didn't see it in time. I heard footsteps. So I didn't want to uh, be caught reading the sign. Flush, you know, it's... You might think I'm here just to steal the loot, but really I'm here as a toilet inspector. Wooden duck. To play within the bath. Turning at the end of the hallway. Yes. Lady Lala Lord Klaus, right? So I haven't been here. Exciting as I thought. 
Any light switches here? Lady Lottie. Right. Getting close to six thousand mark. Most of the guests, I guess, most of the guests are uh, in the gallery looking at all the art, right? sense. Great. Oh, who's making the racket? Me. Who do you think it was? It's an unlabeled kit. I need to see where this guy actually goes. So you just go back and forth. Okay, he sits there for a bit. And he comes back, I think. The other footsteps I'm hearing, I think, is the guard going up and down the hallway. Just an unlabeled key, that's a little weird. Is here, but I'm just going to try this door. Whose room is this? I didn't see a nameplate beside it. It's a bigger room than most, than most of them. Is this Lord Wilson's room himself? It could be. Hello. It wasn't locked, and I do have his key. Let's spend a minute. Lord Wilson's personal journal. My country house is finally finished. Now I can enjoy some peace away from the annoying mother in law. I was very worried that nothing would stop her from moving in with me. They only built this house to get away from, her, from my townhouse and from her. Keeping her out didn't come cheap. I gave her personal physician, Dr. Knopf, three gold bars to convince the woman that rural life would be unhealthy. It was worth it. Dr. Knopf kept his word, and today I received a letter from the mother-in-law expressing an intention to remain in the city. Truly, Dr. Knopf was worth every ounce of that gold. That woman sent a picture of herself and thinks that I'll hang it up. I threw it into a closet. Yes, I knew it. I'd rather not stare at her ugly face. Well, maybe I'll have it hung in the servants' quarters. The sight of her scowling face might scare that lazy bunch into working harder. Meanwhile, she's planning to marry me off to some girl in her clan. I think not. Bad enough that my wife died so young, leaving behind a mother and no children. Now I'm lumbered with that horrid woman who is forcing me to flee to the countryside. But I have other plans. Before the mother-in-law can fulfill her wedding ploy, I'll be remarried. This time it'll be to someone befitting of my social standing, a noblewoman. Lady Carla would have been my first choice, but her father, Lord Ashton, had to marry her off to that mope Andre, Sir Hrothgar's son. That's regrettable, but I've already reconsidered. Lady Lottie, recently widowed, has inherited a fortune from her late husband. I reckon her cigarette business and my soap factory would make for a good partnership. How about cigarettes for the scent of lilac? And for hardcore smokers, soap with a tobacco aroma. I stand to make a fortune with these ideas. I'm sure that Lady Lottie won't refuse me, but I'll have to do something about her perfume first. It smells of burrick and is quite disgusting. The Raymond's Creek, Creek Butcher smells the same and it's literally nauseating. But that shouldn't be a problem for me, the country's leading soap manufacturer. Wait, wasn't she wasn't she having an affair with the butcher? Was 
But someone was, I don't remember who. I'll explain why the butcher smelled the same. But if you rubbed off on him. Alright, let's uh, go down this. I guess it's the bathroom here, right? Yes. Make sure his toilet works. QA passed. Oh. Visibility potion. Speed potion. Alright, good to remember that I've got those. Even if I likely won't use them, because they're not usually my first choice of tools to think of, but uh, knowing they're there is half the battle. Well, that's a good timing, because I need him to be in that room when I go into it, because he sits there and faces the wall. Uh, gotta stay on my toes anyway. Ah, it's not that dark though. That'll do. Oh, there's nothing else in here. What's with this? Uh -huh. Don't hide the loot from me. Well, you probably can't hide most of the loot from me, but not all of it. Okay, I guess we're done with the Bedrooms then. Head back down the hallway. Okay, he's going past the, the distant guard, that is. Which is good timing for me. If he's standing, you're going to be standing in front of the picture for a little bit. I think that means I'm done with this floor? Yeah, well, very close to the 7,000 gold. Perfect. I haven't done that area, where those two guards are. Oh, we've got multiple people walking around here. I thought it was the one guy. Okay, he's got a purse I have not stolen. But he's got guards coming this way as well. Oh, he, is he... No, he's... Yes, he's coming this way. As long as he's not coming into this room, that's about perfect for me. Oh, where did he go? Oh, no, he went where those guards are going. All right. Well, still right. Come, come. <gasps> How dare you! He's armed! Somebody... Ugh. Well, that was unfortunate, Sir Hrothka. I really should take him to his bed, shouldn't I? Self-imposed challenge. Which way is he going? Did he go down the hallway? I think Sir Hrothgar's room was... Oh, where was it? I don't remember. Is he turning left? Yes. Not again. I guess it's nothing now. It's Lord Ashton. Mr. Rothgrass was down here then. Mm -hmm. Huh? Uh. What? Uh. Nothing, nothing. Uh. Sleep, but not too, not, don't sleep too well, that would be, uh, not so good for me. Let's just go. Okay. Oh, now I don't remember what, now those two guards are going to be a nuisance. Too close. So 
Maybe I'll have enough time. Why is there nothing in here except a uh, loot goal? Nothing in here but a bit of loot. No patch of darkness. Okay, well, they better not be coming back then. Anytime soon. Oh, that's right. They come back round anti clockwise. Well, that's right. I can hide in. Here if I need to. I don't want to run into those two guards face first. That would be problematical. Who's, who was opening a door and where? Oh, was that that guy on the ground floor? Right, there's a door open to my left somewhere. That might be the guards coming back. Yep. Yep, that's the two of them. Oh, this is actually very good timing. They'll walk by and he'll walk by. And I can follow him and uh, go where they came from. What is that smell? It smells like old meat. Who's that? I can hmm, guess it was nothing. I'm not sure how he even noticed me there. Who's making those noises? Wait, have I been here? Another long hallway that goes nowhere? I mean, to a sitting room sort without a light switch. But it has loot, so, you know, we'll, we'll take it. Oh, it's a gambling room table. Alright. here again. Okay. Nobody knows. Now, I don't remember if there's another room there by the broom closet that I haven't properly explored. If there is, how do I get there? Oh yeah, that's that was the uh, the bar. Okay, so we go to the big hall and go through the the big double doors in the big hall. And that'll be the dining room. It's not really the bar. Wait, he was down that hallway? Huh. Kind of a surprise to me. Oh no, that's those two guards, that's fine. They're both going down there, that's good timing for me. Who's there? Nope. Oh. Don't think you can hide from Shit. Okay. Then 
we're not going that way. Change of plan. Ah, uh, that's really bad because that's going to desync the two of them. Just see a sword waving around up there. Not at risk of him finding me there, I'm at risk of him being badly desynced with the other guard. He'll be coming out the door any moment now. Yeah, he's just going in. As the other guy comes out. Okay, well. Let's try and make that work. They would see me. I was trying to close the door so I could reach the light switch without moving too much, but uh, <laughs> it did not work out that way. I guess we could get the valuables in the room while I have the opportunity. Then, how am I going to hide from these two when they come back? <laughs> Their pockets. <laughs> I'm not hearing any guards. I saw him. The thief. I saw him. Oh, there's an angry guard. Okay. some reason. Stop this villain! Someone! Oh, well, I don't mind if he runs off to get help. That's okay. If he runs away again, maybe get him on the way back. I need the guard to calm down and go back to patrolling. Don't come this way, man. Don't come this way. I want to save your retinas. She's calmed down. <clears throat> I warned you, man. I'm kind of surprised she didn't notice anything, but maybe he'll just be sleeping there. We can steal all the gold candles, all the cakes, or um, maybe don't go too close to that, to that side. These were simply not what they were on Father's Day. He would never have seen such insolence, such disrespect. Such cake stealing. Floggings, I can tell you. Oh, floggings. Hmm. Do either of you have a purse on you by any chance? Doesn't look like it. No. Alright. 
Are these valuable? No. Well, that's him again. He's still hunting for me, okay? He's just not looking in the right place. He just comes down now and walks past, and I can just. Guards! Thief! Don't let him get away! <gasps> Seriously, man. You're gonna get me in trouble with everybody else, Lord Wellhofer. He just passed out after eating too much cake. That was, that was weird. Oh, this guy didn't see me. Alright, objectives wise, what are we doing? Where are we at? We've got our loot goal, we haven't killed anybody, we haven't found the treasure vault, we haven't gone to his main art display, so we definitely have uh oh, balcony of the main entrance and give Leon the signal. What is the signal? How do I give Leon the signal? I don't know. Thief! Stop him! You too? Fine, go. Why are you making such a fuss? Mm -hmm. I kind of wanted to come here, but that'll do. Well, he'll calm down and he'll get back to his patrol in there. All be good. I just need to find a, what's a good way out. Back out to the yard. That's what we do. All right. I guess it's time to tackle this area, right? But uh, we'll do that next episode. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.